Happening right now, teachers packing up, students forced to do classes online after a school building is deemed unsafe. Thanks for joining us here at 10. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Marley Ginter. This is happening on the American River College campus. That's where we find CBS 13's Hunter Sowards tonight. Hunter? It is pretty quiet here at Davies Hall. It's only going to get quieter over the next couple of days because these doors, they are locked. Nobody is going to be allowed inside. And that's already causing major disruptions with classes just starting three weeks ago. Take a look at what they had to say. Professors emptying out their offices and classrooms. It's very disruptive. Hallways lined with moving boxes and carts. Students and staff given just a day's notice to get out. I find it very inconvenient. It's the unexpected evacuation of Davies Hall at American River College due to concerns over earthquakes. There could be catastrophic um, failure in this building. President Lisa Cardoza says Davies Hall was built in 1967 and a recent structural survey shows it does not meet current state seismic safety standards. Its lift slab architectural design could crumble if there was an earthquake. With the information that we had, any event could potentially bring this building down and we just couldn't take that risk. The shutdown surprising to many on campus. I've never really noticed or felt uh, earthquakes so I never thought that it would be a huge concern here. Davies Hall is the college's biggest building with 80 faculty offices and 200 classes here this semester. This really is impacting everyone across campus. For the next two weeks, all classes that have been here will now be held online. After that, officials hope to find new spaces on campus for the classes to come back and finish out the semester. It's going to be pretty chaotic for two weeks at least. I think it'll be a bit harder to go online. Professors now scrambling to change their lesson plans. My initial response was feeling overwhelmed and then I put that aside and said, okay, let's let's problem solve this. Campus officials say the fate of Davies Hall is still unknown. There won't be an answer or a solution in the next weeks or months. We think this is a years long process. Yeah, and here are those options. So they could bring in retrofit, seismic retrofits here to this to make those repairs. Another option, though, that could be cheaper because that one would cost millions would be to just tear it down and start over. But as you heard, this is going to be a very long process in deciding what exactly is going to happen here at Davies Hall. We have been seeing the last of those professors, though, wheeling out what was inside their classrooms or those offices. Definitely a tall task with very little notice. Yeah, definitely. And what terrible timing for this to happen, right? right. It's a school huge start. building. Not good. All right. Thank you, Hunter.